Hello viewers, uh, in this video we are going to see a very interesting brand. Uh, it, the brand is uh, Little Trees, which is a brand of car freshener from uh, US. Now why this is interesting is because of, uh, <coughs> because this brand actually shows in real time uh, or in real world how a design can help build a brand. When we look at uh, the history of this brand, uh, it has a very interesting uh, story behind uh, its creation. Now this brand was, uh, is almost 70 years uh, old. It was created by a chemist uh, called Julius Saman. Now he created this uh, car freshener as a solution to one of his friend's problem. <coughs> now his friend was a uh, milkman who had his uh, milk truck. And uh, this, his friend was always upset because of the bad smell uh, from the leftover <coughs> or the spilt milk in his truck. Um, so uh, Julius Summon, who uh, was interested in aroma uh, related uh, you know, scientific experiments, uh, started looking for a solution. And he created a, a, a car a freshener or a freshener for the truck. Uh, from the aroma from a pine trees uh, and and uh, he created a uh, a unique uh, material uh, in the in the form of uh, a evergreen tree uh, so he designed this uh, <coughs> this uh, product uh, as shown in this uh, powerpoint uh, and and the scent was applied to this a string was attached to this <coughs> uh, a pine tree uh, shaped or this evergreen sh uh, tree shaped uh, <coughs> freshener which <coughs> can be dangled on the uh, rear view mirror uh, rear view mirror inside the <coughs> truck uh, so if you, if you look at uh, this brand uh, you, can, you can see what, what can be the <coughs> possible lessons that a marketeer can learn uh, so when we look at this uh, brand you can see that it's a very simple product it's a car freshener <clears throat> but how is it different it is differentiated by uh, design now he has designed the, <clears throat> the packaging or the product form itself uh, to reflect the source of the products efficacy or the products uh, uh, purpose <clears throat> now uh, so that that particular uh, concept is called as a trade trust trade trust is a uh, is a <coughs> visual design whereby the customer by looking at the design itself can understand the uh, uh, from uh, understand the source of uh, the band's ability to perform the task <clears throat> so by looking at this uh, uh, the uh, design of uh, little trees the consumer knows that this uh, <coughs> car freshener's aroma is from uh, is derived from uh, these trees, uh, and later, of course, a lot of aroma or different uh, flavors were added into the range of uh, car fresheners. So it's a very very simple uh, product. But what the founder has done uh, was that the founder has created a unique design. He has copyrighted or he has uh, trademarked the design. And uh, it is said that the company very, very rigorously pursue uh, trademark infringement. So there are a lot of uh, uh, enthusiasm and uh, I would say that a uh, lot of thought has been uh, there uh, from the founder to make sure that this uh, design is protected. Uh, and another important uh, advantage of this product is that uh, the brand is visible by design itself. So you are supposed to dangle this uh, car freshener on that uh, rear view mirror inside the car. Uh, and everyone from the outside can see this little tree uh, you know, dangling and, and it's, it's very familiar. So I have seen a lot of, uh, lot of times so when this product is available, uh, it was already familiar uh, to me and I just bought it. Uh, so the, here what are the... Uh, the marketeers have done is that the product form itself becomes a very powerful brand element and that brand element was uh, uh, also acts as a very obvious advertisement for the brand so uh, the other examples of trade dress includes the coca-cola bottle which is again a trademarked uh, design and by that uh, 
the shape of that bottle itself will uh, remind the customer of uh, the brand so that so uh, what is the lesson see when you are designing the product itself you can incorporate uh, brand elements into the design and you can design the product form in such a manner that it is differentiated by uh, the design and it also acts as a uh, advertisement in terms of reminding the customer about what the product does or what the product's uh, source of equity is so a very little uh, very small product uh, a, a, very, a car freshener product becoming globally successful because of the design uh, and the protection that the marketeer has or the company has done for making sure that these designs are not copied by the competitors so it's a beautiful uh, <coughs> brand story and uh, a lot of things can be learned from uh, little trees as a brand so if you uh, like this video please uh, like and subscribe to this channel so that you will get a lot of informative in future so thank you for your patient listening